we are going to play a little different, some Heroes of the Storm. So, you know, thought I would, uh, I don't get a chance to play Heroes a lot. And as you can see from my Silver 4, I'm not particularly good at the game. Um, I used to be better, and uh, I think I got up to Platinum at one time, but... Yeah, I just, um, I sort of stopped playing here and there, and I play sporadically, and, um, I think I'm okay, I'm just not great. I think that I, I don't make some, I'm okay mechanically, I'm, I'm sort of like a mid guy that, uh, so, yeah, you're welcome to sort of watch, watch me play this game, it's silver, and you can see even in silver I'm, you know, 42%. So we got a game. We'll see where we're going here. I had a warm-up game already that I lost. Uh, so we'll go into this one. Um, and I don't mind, actually. You know, I think I used to take the game a lot more seriously, but now. Um, so I am banning. And for myself, I even like to just ban a Garrosh. I think for me and a lot of people in Silver, um, Garrosh is just an absolute pain to deal with. Um, I'll see if someone wants to actually pick Joe on our team. So we are first pick, so I won't ban Joe immediately. Like maybe someone actually wants to pick Joe. For Battlefield, I I generally like either Syl like of my main DPSs, I like either Sylvanas or Li Ming or Vala. So we'll see what they can do. Um, someone wants to tank. I could do sort of anything. Um they banned Joe, that's fine. I think, I don't, so if I'm doing this one, the, the thing that I, what do we have? We have a tank already. So since we have a tank, I like banning Diablo here. He's really good in those all those tight corners. So since we have a Tyrael, with a Tyrael, I wouldn't mind doing something that's gonna support the Tyrael. Um, maybe that is a Vala? I mean, I always like Vala, and this she's very good on this. And and we got a Morales, so that's pretty good. So I may first pick Vala here, actually. I'm gonna first pick Vala. Yeah, I'll first pick Vala, which I think is a good pick for here, just in general. Um, what am I riding on her? She's fine. Yeah, but yeah, I mean, I play heroes. You know, it's sort of. I don't play a lot of video games these days, but when I do get a chance to play some heroes, I like to play. And uh, I don't take it too seriously. I, I fully admit I'm not great at this game. So, um, those are two good picks. I mean, Artanis is fine here, especially for this level. I mean, you know, Artanis is great, good against the Vala, and Rainer is great too. So, two good picks. I like... Uh, I mean, this is a good one too. Tyrael is... I play Tyrael as one of my main tanks, and I love Tyrael. I'm actually very good with Tyrael. I mean, my win percentage is pretty good with Tyrael. So, I uh, I like Tyrael as a tank. Um, what is my Tyrael? I think I'm pretty good with her. I mainly play DPSs, but I'm also not... Yeah, 56%. I'm pretty good with Tyrael. Um, but we'll sort of see. You can probably play Tyrael two different ways. I like to play him the easy way. The easy way to play Tyrael is to go Judgment. The hard way to play Tyrael is to go the Sanctification. Judgment at Silver in these lower ranks, Judgment is so good. Because so many people want to fight until they're low, and it's just an auto-kill for people. So Judgment is really good. For here, I'm just going to continue to ban tanks, and that's probably Muradin? I think Muradin is a great ban. I'm going to ban Stitches, actually. Stitches is so good at lower ranks because so many people are out of position. And Gorge is so strong. Like, I, I'm more banned based on... I think that these tanks are so good at low... Like, I think um, Garrosh and Stitches too. Stitches is so easy to play. that And just the hooks. And the hooks... Uh, Karazim is interesting pick. He's probably going to go block. And Karazim players, you know, I that's a, a comfortable pick. He's a high... Anytime I see people at this level playing high skill cat people, like Kara, like, it makes, makes me feel good. So the Karazim is what I like to see. The Leo, and so these are really good too. This is actually a pretty good team with a Kale Foss. Kale Foss is out in the Leo. I mean, Leo is all about, again, what makes Leo so great is the Entomb. As long as he doesn't go the dance, what's it called? The, the 
walk. Oh, I'm sorry, the march. <laughs> the the march, the dance. He goes to the dance. The march of the dead. That's it. So I think he's pretty good. They're going to go for a tank here. And hopefully I've squeezed out a lot of the really good tanks. They can still go Muradin. Muradin's is always a good pick. ETC is followed too. So ETC... I, I went. I really struggle about ETC, but the good thing about ETC is he's pretty relatively weak, and he's very susceptible to. Um, the thing is, is that mosh pit only hits certain times. Stitches, you know, especially at this lower level, and a lot of people clunk up. Stitches is so good at Silver League because every like fourteen or fifteen seconds, it's effectively like a you know he's got those hooks, and those hooks will just win games. And then Gorge is. I mean, Gorge is basically a hero dead. And this lower, and I speak for myself too. So many people are constantly out of position, including myself, that it's really good. I do I have a decent ball. Um, I'm going to go out our attack build just because I like playing. I, I fully admit that like I definitely play these characters how I like to play them. So I'm not, you know. I go full auto attack build, but I also feel I can do that with Morales. You know, Morales is so good. Um, and I've got Tyrael as well, and a secondary support. So I feel pretty good about this one. Um, yeah, I've played Heroes off and on for... Jeez, I mean, it's been... Man, probably seven years, I think. 2016, 2017. So I feel pretty good about this one. The Rainer... I'm not going to trade well into the Rainer, but the Karazim, I think... It's all about Manticore. I think once I get, you know, with Vala, the whole idea is you want to play passive with her until 16 and 20 when you get Far Flight Clipper. And you've, so I really don't want to go crazy with her. I'm, not, I'm actually a pretty passive Vala. Like, I'm just, I don't, I really don't try to do any fancy plays with her. I play Vala very passive because I don't want to lose my stacks. And I really, for me, I, I come online about... It's really about 20 whenever I get a Far Flight Quiver. So I'm going to stay away from that ETC. You know? And I'm just... I'm really just going to take my hits where I want them to. You know, I'm not going to get too close. Going to bar. I'm also sort That's what I'm waiting for. I'm waiting for that. And then once I see that, I'm just going to be a lot more aggressive with him. I'm always going to wait for that... Um, for his um, slide. I forgot what it's called. It's fine. Leo and Art's generally a good matchup. Yeah, oops. Oh, very good play, actually. So he did get me. And I really have to be so careful. The thing with ETC is, and I, you know, I always try to stay away from that uh, slide. His slide is so good. And uh, you have to, I play, that Jaina was, Jaina was a really good play, actually. Just followed up so well on it. That's a good Jaina. Someone who's just going to hold her hold her spells and then just go in, you know. I think... Yeah, we got this Tyrael going in. And, oh, okay, good. He's going to go in. Yeah, that's a really good ETC. So, yeah, maybe another draw. Oh, there we go. See, other Valas would have probably went into that. See, but I'm going to be... I'm sort of a chicken Vala. I play very passive with her. And that's just because I know my skill cap. Like, I think there's some Valas which are... I think the great cardinal mistake with Vala is being too aggressive with her. I just try to do what I can. And, like, you know... I'm generally a person who's going to play behind my tank a lot. I would always... I sort of have the opinion I'm, I try to be more... Passive and just stay behind my tank. Really wait. I know we got this ETC who's probably in shadow. So again, I'm just going to try to stay back a little. Okay, they're going after that. That's fine. I'm just going to back off. Oh, great. He got that. So I am going to pressure that ETC once he did that. We got a one-on-one -on -one here. That's a really bad thing for Leo. But Leo is pretty good. that trade good. good all right let's just go that's a really good kill for me i'm just gonna go in here and i'm just gonna start trading i'm 
We're not going to make it in time, so I'm just going to try and chip off as much as I can. That's fine. I'm going to defend here. Material is bought. That's fine. We'll just defend. Oh, we can't defend. Auto attack. That's my bad. I thought that auto attack was still locked onto Jaina. Oh man, that's fine. Oh, it's still pretty good. Yeah, it's fine. And you can see here, I'm not like this fantastic Vala. I'm just sort of good enough. That's fine. I think that's okay. That's all good. As long as you don't have anyone die here, it's fine. trade that way. Yeah, that KP is dead. Fun. It's all good. It's fun. We're not doing bad. I mean, I think, you know, I I got some stacks, but the main thing I the stacks are secondary. The big thing that I don't you don't want to do as well is die. You know. Okay. We'll just pressure somebody. Again, other people are starting to fight. I'm just going to clear this immortal. Damn, I got Hot Pursuit. Hot Pursuit is another very important thing for Vala. To just give you that extra maneuverability. It's very important for Hot Vala. So, okay, I'm going to leave. <laughs> That's my bad. Luckily that ETC was fine. If it wasn't an ETC, I'd probably... I didn't know what that Tyrael was going to do. So I, I may... Again, a better Vala probably would have engaged that ETC expecting that Tyrael to, like, support him. But you also sort of... The thing at this level is that you don't know, but you're... You really don't... You can't trust sort of trust people. So I, you don't know. So anyway, I'm... Oh, we got an ETC here. I'm definitely going to do that. Dodge that. Again, they're not focusing me. That's fine. Ooh. Calculated. That's fine. And that's fine. I was... Again, they come late and that's the thing that like I'm very careful to try to make these engagements because if you're if you're expecting your teammates to come to your aid when they're supposed to you don't know that so my view is as I always especially with Vala I always like to play her very solid oh couldn't get it all right I like the Reign of Vengeance is really great especially with the ETC Mosh just Reign of Vengeance is very good for that Mosh I think we press here I'm just going to go trade up. My teammates are going to engage. That's fine. Oh, that hurt. That hurt. I'm just gonna stay back here because I'm I'm basically out of this one. I'm not gonna now They're gonna say something, but I'm so low that again I'm just gonna trade. Okay, that Morales is here for me, that's great. Perfect. 
good. Okay, he's going there. That's fine. Wouldn't have minded trading up against that. I think we go top, honestly, because we're so pushed back here. Okay, I'm going to back off. That's not good. That Jaina is... When you see that Jaina coming, you know that they got people right there. The morale is, you know, at this level, you're not trying to do anything crazy. I'm just going to pressure that Jaina away from us. Okay, I got hit. That hurt. Oh, I missed him. Back off. Got him. Oh, hello. All right, let's leave. Not bad. Uh, we're not doing bad. We're down a fort, but we're up a level. So, you know, this is what I really don't like. Yeah, I'm getting out of here. I'm dead. I can't. One thing I've learned at this low level, you cannot save people. Like, you're just going to die yourself. Really didn't like them staying there. We're giving up a fort. We're going to lose keep, probably. I didn't know why we were staying there. That is what that is. Uh, maybe they will go after a camp, which would be great for us. Okay, the good thing is, is that they didn't push, which maybe that would have been a bad decision anyway. They are going for our camp, That's, but that's fine. No, it's just, I'm gonna say no, maybe yes. I guess we'll see. Oh, that's rough. Yeah. That was wonderful. Oh, it's the Silver League die for a camp. <laughs> and we do it all the time, too. Like, I was like, are these guys going to go and die for this camp? Oh, it's great. So that's awesome, actually. We did great. We're going to go to the Immortal, and we're going to push, so that's great. And you see, for me, I don't even have the best damage. Like, I just, you know, I'm not, I'm sort of a very passive Vala. I think a, a more aggressive Vala, I mean, we got Tyrael, actually, with number one damage. And that's fine, actually. Like, I, I don't really, you know, I don't play, I would rather play Vala passive and not die than try to do anything crazy with her. Just gonna go here. I'm gonna clear this. Manticore is great. So I'm starting to really come on here. I do, like, I do a lot better with Vala once I get Far Flight Quiver. And you can kind of see my strategy with Vala sort of paying off. Again, our opponents just have one person. We don't need Morales there, but that's fine. You just got to accept the fact that some people, I mean, that's just how it is. Anyway, so we've got uh, Ringer coming back up here. That's good. Okay, at least Leo is there. That's fine. The rest of the guys, I'd love if they were further up, but that's fine. So I'm going to wait for my team. We're done. Pressure off of him. That's fine. That's fine. I mean, uh, we got it. We got a fort, and that's probably fine. I need to tap. 
Um, I've got some pretty good stacks, actually. And only died once. That's a key thing that I always say. With Vala, you don't want to die. I That's my opinion. I would much rather play her more passive. And just get in chip damage. No, don't do that. Don't. So we died. I can just piss back off. Like, I think it's fine. We got our main tank. Like, let's just stick together. Yeah, let's just stick together. It's fine. Like, it's just a can. Let's not make their mistake. It's just a camp. We're fine. Yeah, they get that. That's fine. We'll just clear. Let's just push the lanes. That's good. Generally, I like our team. Like Our team is not trying to go crazy with the camps like their team did, which just made a huge mistake where they just just died because they just wanted to camp. ETC, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stay. So what I'm here, I'm just trying to stay and avoid getting seen. Just going to put some damage on ETC. Get him. Not a terrible loss. I can we do. I'm just gonna try to pressure. We do have Leo. I don't know what happened there. I mean, I was, you know. You gotta watch that Jaina. That Jaina is really good. So it's a, it's a 2v3. That's not great. We do have Leo coming back. He doesn't want to take that shot. That's fine. I mean, I think we're out of this game until we get... That's fine. We just have to defend. I mean, that's... Wait us. I mean, we, we don't have our guys yet. I don't think we even try to do that. There's no reason for us to even be there. We're going to defend top. I think we can actually defend this. Again, if we don't do anything crazy, I'm going to ask Tyrael to go away. That's fine. So, okay, we'll just sort of see. Alright. And again, they're all grouping up. Again, I'm at 19, so I think once I get Far Flight Quiver, that ETC is going to have problems. I just need to... You know, with Vala, it's sort of just getting to Far Flight Quiver. He burned his thing. That's very good. I'm just going to pre-cap here. That's fine. That Artanis is super good. Yeah. That. That's fine. I would love for us to actually press forward with three dead. That's fine. Oh, I missed it. Oh, I really would have. I really didn't see the need to have all those. I was hoping that. I was really hoping some of them would have come and then we could have. I don't know. I probably should have just cleared away, but I just felt that we could have really done a little more, but maybe that was my mistake. I was hoping to get a few more picks. Like, I felt they were going to stay around, but it's fine. That's fine. I mean, like, a few extra 10% on our keep isn't that big of a deal. Alright. Well, so, we'll see what they're doing. I guess we're going to group. So, he's coming in. That's not good. I sort of... Dodge. 
I would love for us to push here. Yeah. Oh! Death March. That's fine. Let's go for the keep. Good Trey, that's that's game right there. <laughs> GG. All right, well that's a game of heroes. Hope you liked it. Good morale as play. So yeah, let me know what you think. Oh, I got the KT. And you can see I, I ramped up my damage a lot more. Once I was sort of able to get at those higher levels, I was very passive early. And I only had one death. So, like I said, pretty good. Pretty good. Thanks, guys.